Alex. I'm Bermuda. I'm Phil, and today we're going to be playing City Skylines. Um, more accurately, I'm going to be playing City Skylines. Phil can I'm see. I'm going to be kind of directing. Yeah, well, kind of directing. I'm basically a puppet that Phil is going to manipulate verbally. <laughs> no, uh, well, you know, we'll see. Yeah. Dance, puppet, dance. Son of a... Is that you? Hey, for a second, it's not me okay. anymore. Yeah, I thought it was me, because it's usually me, it's usually on my end. Um, but no, so I'm I'm in control of the game, Phil's in control of me, he can see the game, you can see the game. I've never played, I haven't even clicked new game yet, I literally just launched the game and that's it. So I've adjusted some like sound volume things and that's it. I don't even know the controls. Okay. Mostly mouse driven. Yeah, okay. You have a mouse. It squeaks. It's a squeaky mouse. Gets the grease. So, the first thing you do is create a new game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just, I kind of feel like I'm forgetting something or that something has to happen first. I don't know, my mind is in a weird place no, today. Just press new game. Yeah, 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 but... Fine. So the thing is, you want to choose where you want to go. All these places, generally, it's considered that the top ones are easier and the bottom ones are harder. Oh yeah, they've got like ratings for I don't know farming resources. They're all pretty much equal, aren't they? Yeah, but I mean, like it's like land mass and road connections and stuff like that. It's like it's it's easier to make a nice city that has like good connections and stuff on the top ones because it's got like good connections for later on but like uh, the, it's just a little harder to connect it up correctly kind of thing than the lower ones I think well it's really here that you start getting things that aren't connected like all of these are have the same connections but like different mm. like area for building so it's like 60 70 76 74 percent but they're all like, kind of roughly the same yeah so meh. Meh. it seems my push to talk button is kind of interfering with the game which i was afraid might happen but you know deal with it well there yeah so it has the most water i'm doing it doing it black woods uh, yeah, doable. I mean, we can start again. Oh, what do you want to call it? Ductopia? Usually I just go with the first thing that comes to my head. That's how I got the name Bermuda. It was actually the first thing that came to my head. Um, so let's just find out what happens. Cronions? <laughs> Cronions. Beautiful. Cronions. But it has to be like called something. Cronions. Cronions B. There we go. Right. <laughs> Help me. <laughs> so you've played city builders before in the past, right? Mm, not exactly. You know the basic way city builders work. So you How start. It was. In uh, in Make the bottom left hand stop. corner. Bottom left hand corner. Yeah, press that until it shows up. Uh, there you go. Is there like a keyboard shortcut for that? Uh, it's probably spacebar. It is spacebar. Um, yeah. So the first thing you want to do basically is look at the land map. So if you scroll out, you can see where you want to see like everywhere. And then you kind of think about how am I going to plan this kind of thing. You start off in, in the top left hand corner, like there's a thing that you can click, but like it pretty much shows nothing because we haven't unlocked anything. The very first thing you have to do is build and then destroy a bit of road, unless you unless you're happy with how you've built that bit of road.
I thought there was a way that like you could play with like nothing locked, like everything's unlocked in the start. Uh, there is. Uh, I've forgotten how to get to it. Open your options a sec. Uh, gameplay. Oh, maybe it's here. Uh, unless it's a something we start the map with kind of thing, so it's something you don't like unlock. Mm. Let me quickly check the internet. Uh, we can play it the fair way. But oh, no, that's fine. I thought it's like easier when things are unlocked because, like, if the only thing, if the only road you can build. Uh, oh. No, but literally the second you've built a millimetre of road and then deleted it, you can build pretty much all of the starting roads. Oh, okay, great. I'll just do that. It's how the, why the game is a bit funny. It's like... So yeah, just build like that, finish building it, and then now you've got more roads unlocked. Uh. You can t click on the other like tabs on the top. Like you are eventually going to have to update roads, and you can upgrade them once they're down. It's just a tiny bit fiddly. Also, hello, Games T. I saw your message. Come to watch me flail around in a game I've never played, and to answer your question, Phil, which you asked at the beginning, and I did not have the opportunity to clarify the last time I played a city builder game was one of the SimCity games when I was... 12? Right. I don't know. And so yeah, you basically know how it works. Because it pretty much hasn't changed. <laughs> yeah, okay. So, do you want to look for it in? No. Do you want me no. to look for it? Okay. No. We'll just do like this. Right. So, uh, I don't know which way you set the roads to be running, either like American way or European way, whatever. So, you. What? American way and European way. Plenty of places in Europe drive on the right. You mean the wrong. <laughs> <laughs> well, let me tell you a thing about driving on the left versus driving on the right, because it seems like it's an arbitrary, like, well, you know, just flip a coin and pick one because mm -hmm. it doesn't matter. Um, the majority of people are right-handed, correct? There are left-handed people, but they are yeah. a minority. Yeah. And um, if a person is driving a car... Uh, it, even if they're just driving down the center of the road, not one side or the other, uh, if they're driving and uh, there there is something in the road that they have to swerve around or something that they want to avoid, people will tend to turn towards the way of like the hand that they favor, their their preferred uh, pr like preferred, preferred. hand. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Um, so they'll they'll turn that way like in an instant like that's their first reaction. So left-handed people will turn left, right-handed people will turn right. If you're driving on the right and you turn right because most people are right-handed, they'll turn right. You're just going to go off the road, but left-handed people are going to turn into oncoming traffic. However, if you drive on the left, such as in the UK and like places in the world where the UK has had enough influence to like influence people to drive that way, such as Australia or Cyprus or whatever. Um, the right-handed people, which is most people, will turn right into oncoming traffic because the oncoming traffic is on your right because you're driving on the left. That seems more dangerous to me, and that seems like a logical case for driving on the right. When I'd, I'd have to say, like, citation needed here kind of thing. Because, like, I'd imagine that while there is a lot of, like, lizard brain taking control, oh my god, stuff's happening uh, thing. There is also the 
you're probably going to want to swerve into the ditch rather than into more traffic. Yeah, like people are going to actually think swerve to the safest like, way. Rather than like just be automatic stupid person brain kind of thing. But do you want to count on like do you want your safety to depend on people actually thinking or do you want your, to be on the safer side and just be like well if that's their reflex reaction then you know. Well I I I personally just like to see how much like how much statistics of like people swerving into the middle of the middle line and like swerving out kind of thing like you know I'll get you, you those you statistics yeah you're never gonna know until we've seen proper statistics of it what the hell So generally whenever I start one of these, I, I make basically a circle between those two lines. Uh, so it's like like tip. So that, you know, you can go this, oops, so you can go that way, that way, or straight, kind of. No, I, I like scroll in back to it again. So if we turn to the side, so like you do like a rotate thing, which is that, right? So. One Imagine goes this the way. thing that comes off the the thing that comes off the like freeway uh, is like a pair of bollocks, and you're drawing a dick. <laughs> then the thing I want is is like a that thing on the tip. I just wanted to draw like a tip, but you can make it bigger or you can make it like smaller or whatever. Just like. Because if you close that reach a milestone thing, which is the bottom left, just by clicking X, okay, and close that and go back to the roads menu you can see that there's straight line roads, squiggly roads and different other methods which are the four circles to the left of it oh I was looking for this so the way this one works is you draw a line which is the angle that it's going to come out and then once you've clicked, it then starts drawing it. Oh, well, that's what I was trying to do in the first place by building this little bit. So, the best way to do that is right-click again. Yeah, go further, further right, further right, further right. Okay, there you go. You can see how it makes it makes the angle from where you've drawn to. If you now like move your mouse up, you see the angle that it comes from, like that. This is gonna be fun. It doesn't have to be perfect when we start. It we does if I do it. Later. <laughs> What'd you say about lumps? I said we can change it later. So it doesn't have to be perfect. If I do something, it has to be perfect. Right. So the the, way, the best way of thinking about it is like uh, you can, you can calculate by how many lines you make. So yeah, you've got to go two out if you're gonna go that one, and then you go two down. Yeah, like that. 
I think you went two on the first one and then three lines on the second one. Yeah, because I was trying to operate on a hybrid of lines and vision, but my vision was skewed because I was looking weird, but now I'm looking top down so I can see better like what I'm doing, so mm. that helps. Right, so fucking oh well, good. Enough. It's 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 fine, pretty much. So the question you always ask yourself now is: Is it better to have a tiny little conjoining bit or not? And at the start, it's pretty much better to link those two roads, so it's a full circle. And later on, it's better to like remove the link when it gets more traffic. Which way does traffic flow here? I mean, is this two that way. ways? These are two ways, like each yeah. three lanes is this way and this is the other way? This is but why this it's incoming to is, them. Or it's better just to use a one-way thing. Yeah. Or link them. Simplest thing, I just... I don't know. It just seems like a... Bad intersection because like people yeah, no, who want to come it here. Is. That's why I'm saying later on it's going to be hellish and you want to delete it. But right now, it's it's really useful. Uh... Or I could have just done this with a six lanes all in the same direction. You so can't just... build on you... that. What do you mean I can't build on that? You see how there's squares coming off the road you've got at the moment. Uh -huh. Those things don't come off one of those six lane things. Really? Oh, is that a highway you selected, or is that I don't like know what this is. a six, it's a... six lane, one way? Yeah. Oh no. Okay. So yeah, that that Let's would work. What, that would what work. This is. So yeah, that would work. Yeah. Okay. And then this. Oh, I really only need three though, because it's three incoming. You know what I mean? Unless you want to just future proof it and just have six. Yeah, might as well, yeah. I think you could, could have just pressed the upgrade button on all of those. Yeah? Yeah. I upgraded it to one-way roads. The, one, the bad thing about one-way roads is specific, like, infrastructure, like, has an area of influence that it comes off, like, to do with what roads it can go down. So if, like, it can't go down a road because there's, like, it's one way, that ends up meaning that, like, it, uh, it, like, doesn't have all the influence that it could have because there's a bunch of one-way roads. Oh, and yes, we have drawn that backwards. What do you mean? You, we needed to start on the bottom one and come round to the top one rather than start on the top one and come round to the bottom one. How can you tell? They look the same to me. Because you see that little dead end sign that's flashing at the end of those two things? Okay, yeah. That means that you've done it the one, wrong way around. Haha! <laughs> I think I have a feeling this is the last time we're going to play this game on stream. <laughs> <laughs> Starting on the bottom one. This is the bottom. Nothing. I feel like like two lines and two lines isn't exactly. I think that's probably it. The mm -hmm. issue the issue comes from the fact that it's two lines and a and, and a bit nub. from yeah. like this next one. But where that straight line is and it meets the other straight line, then that's correct. So maybe just do a like a little novel there, okay. What? I don't wait. Like this? Okay. Yeah. I 
I'm gonna. That sound is bugging me. Is it a little too loud for you? To like smash. The, I'm no, planting like something. Oh. Every time I move, I it's enjoy like so that annoying. sound. You do? It's like. It's like termites or something in the wall, and it's like. It, <laughs> it, it's like the sound of someone drawing blueprints. It's like. Uh, like shading in blueprints. It sounds like termites. <laughs> yeah. Why okay. is it still not perfectly circular? Because Why? When when you got to the bottom of the tip right now, in, instead of making like a, a, a millimeter long road, which is like the space you have in between the other two roads at the at the top. Oh. You just continued. Oh. Okay. Well, yeah. that'll just be my Navajo square then. Navajo square. It's something I've heard quilters say about any mistake that they've made in their quilt. Oh, that's what makes it special kind of thing. Uh, Unique. No. They, the, the way I've heard them explain it is that the Navajo people, any time they created something, mm -hmm. they would deliberately put a flaw in it because in their mind, only God could create something perfect. Oh. So you, you can't create anything perfect. Everything you do has to have a flaw in it. And so wow. like, the quilters would say, like, this is my Navajo square. Okay. Like, it's just wrong. Oh, yeah, okay, okay, I'm done. Yes, okay, moving on. But I was going to say... Oh, I understand that. Okay, so you're gonna say what? Like, so now, because it is a single single way road, it's again better to link that that little tip, because yeah, because then they can keep. Otherwise, going. you yeah, otherwise you have to like go it's out of the city and then back into the city kind of thing yeah. just to like get to the other side. But it's something we're gonna have to like change later. But it's good for now. You don't like. If you come in here and you want to go here, then you just go there. Like you don't have yeah, to but, go out of the city to but come back. Let's come say back. on the left-hand side of your screen right now, there's some people's houses, and on the right-hand side of the screen, yeah, there's okay. there's like where they want to get to. They've got to go yeah. out of the city mm -hmm. and then back into the city. I see. It makes sense. <laughs> what? Oh, I'm just laughing. It does. Yeah. So then these people drive... I'm going to think about the people. These people driving, they can only go this way. Yeah. And they have to just make sure that people coming across here are not coming at them. Then they can go. So that, that, yeah. won't, be, that won't be too problematic. Later on, when we buy the square, which is at the moment to the bottom of our screen, we can then like make it so this in intersection, instead of coming up like this actually goes out like this, so it's much further away, so it causes less traffic problems. Mm. But at the moment, it's like a ball lake, because we can't change all of that road. So you then ask yourself, am I going to start making zones out outwards from this, or am I just going to start by unlocking as much as I can by just placing a load of housing on this circle? I don't think this is a good place for housing. Well, you can get rid of it the second you've unlocked stuff. Alright, is that what you mean? So in order to do that... How can the children learn to read if they can't even fit in the building, Phil? <laughs> is this a school for ants? Hmm. The one directly next to roads. Wow. Oh. So again, there's multiple ways of zoning. With again, like the place where you change between straight roads and stuff like that. This one is like fill area. Mhm. Mm uh, the one after that is like so you click drag. Like select like that. Yeah. <laughs> the one after that is like small circle, so you just paint it, and the other one's like big circle for painting. Okay. So I've placed that. Now unlock a, a thing for me. Well, if no one's going to start living there unless you've unpaused time. I'll just unpause it until something else happens. However, uh, unpause. That person's not going to move in because A, we don't have water, and B, we don't have power. So not even like the bummiest bum wants to live there? No, not even the bummiest bum. Well, he might, but like 
he'll moan about living there full time. On his Twitter or whatever. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so you may as well start with water, so you know where that which one that was. The water. <laughs> Do I so not you need have in, water in you this need town? An in pipe and an out pipe. Uh, if you click on the top left hand corner thing. Yeah, no, the very top left hand corner circle. And click the water thing, yeah. Now, click it again. Oh, I just can't see. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> nope, you can't. Uh, there you go. So that's the direction of the water. Yeah, that's not where we want to take it in then. Uh, no, I know some things. Yeah, he does. There's no water movement here, so. No, that's stagnant. No, we're no, we're fine. We're fine with stagnant water. We just don't want to be pumping sewage out into that non-moving thing. No. So here's fine. No, you you put it out here. Yeah. Under the bridge. Uh huh. Poop town. Gonna bridge. call it poop town. Yeah. Did, is that what you were gonna call it? <laughs> I totally was going to call it Poop Down Bridge. <laughs> and that's what you said. Yeah. So that's so what it's So bring named. up your water thing again. It's up. It's still up. No, no, I didn't not, close not that. It. The, the building water thing. So oh. your bottom bar. What is this then? Just information? That's an information thing. Okay. Yeah. And you don't care about that one at the moment. You care about the, yeah, that one. Water pumping station. You only need one to start off with. This is in and this is out. Yeah. And let's just shake it all about. We do the okie koki and we turn around. That's what it's all about. It's so shallow here, it's gonna be sucking up mud. Yeah, you love it. It's like. It doesn't matter though, does it? No. Well, unless you start doing things with dams and then that actually changes like the water in the entire game and then like. You might have to worry about that. So don't care about pipes, just get an, the outflow one, put it on the other side. You need pipes, Phil. Do pipes in second. Right, so I you know, get a pipe and link both of them, basically. Like it's a like a connecty point. Yeah, there you go. It'll start flashing when you actually start connect connecting to it. Yep. Yeah. No. Yep. Yeah. Right. So pipes don't need to have like don't need to be doubly connected to pipes. They don't need to like run in a line. So if you wanted to like the blue area now that you see has is, water. Like, has water and poop connections. So you could make a square from there that covers all of the like squares that that guy has, not that guy's house. But like you don't need to. You can just make down lines if you wanted or if you're really like preparing for the future you could make two down lines one on either side of the map and then just connect them all the way along or just one downside down line pipe and then just right, put lines across it i'm i'd like to man can i see a grid or something like a nope. better grid than what i have cuz i would like to know how wide is this exactly and then i'll just put like lines exactly as You're not wide as to no too much money one. oh there's no grid you mean yeah I'll just see what happens. I oh, well, it doesn't need to start from there because it's like water there. What is the lay of the land? But I mean, let's say, let's say you made a straight line down the very middle of the map, mm -hmm. and then you can just put lines off from that. Yeah. I guess I'm be building in the middle anyway. Although this peninsula kind of curves this way, so I might favor like the middle here. You know what I mean? Do you know what mm -hmm. I mean? Does that make I sense? Do. No. No. I mean yes. Oh. Of course, that's what you meant. But I mean, we're, we're wasting money if we go too far. So just go to yeah. like there at the moment. We can elongate this later. But for now, just cover the area that you're going from. So, from maybe from that from that line that you just made, just make a cross line to the west and a cross line to the east.
Are these people without water then? Uh, as little, long little, as most of people? the like, because because what's going to happen is that entire like six by like that three by four block is going to become like a house. Mm. So as long as most of the blocks are covered, they're going to be happy. Oh, that sound is. Ah. Okay, electricity <clears throat> now. Right, so you don't want power lines, you basically want wind I'm turbine. I'm seeing what the text is that comes up. Oh no. Yes, nuclear. <laughs> so the darker bits, as you can probably guess, high wind, so they produce more. But they're also noisy. Yeah, but you don't really care about noise too much at the moment. Not at the moment, but for the future. <laughs> I mean, this is going to so, be undesirable anyway, because all the yeah, drainage the poop, is going to be here, so let's just put all the undesirable. Town USA is going to be right yeah, by there. Yeah. So you can see the estimated production going up and down. Eight is the, is the best, pretty much. Yeah. Doesn't get higher than eight. Nope. So the area that's around it is like the area of influence that just get, is getting electricity right now. Mm -hmm. So that thing's now powered. You can either go for a, li a line of like those all the way to the other side, or what's probably better is to just like make another wind turbine on the other side, so you're pre-proofing yourself for having enough electricity. On this side? Yeah. Thing is, for a small amount of money, you can pick it up and move it somewhere else. But why do I want to put it on the other side? Like, why because do I that want thing one on also side? needs electricity. Does it? Or does it have yes. electricity? No. Because it has a blue outline. No, it needs. And I can't just run a line to it. You could. So, why don't I do that? No, if there's a reason, I'm asking the reason. It, like, where where there's power lines, you can't build stuff. Oh. Uh. I mean, you could do it. There's, it's just gonna mean you have to delete it later. Mm -hmm. So if you wanted to put like a, maybe a second one on the right and then just 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 put it on the right, it's fine. So I want two because then that's gonna produce enough power, is what you're saying? Like I need two. Later on, you can buy the better turbines that you can place in water. Well, they have to be placed in water, so this one's pretty good. Yeah, everything's a slow learning process for me. <laughs> so it just has to be like within the area, it doesn't have to like touch the building. Looks like it can't go anywhere from here. Exactly, because you've touched the building with it. There you go. Oh. Maybe it's not sound effects, because it, it hasn't might not seemed to be. have changed it hasn't seemed to have changed whatsoever. To, to me. Oh yeah, much better. Why does it keep doing that? Why? Because it, it's trying to space out the uh, pylons evenly. So you've just got to place it so it places one of the pylons in the correct position and then keep going. Yeah, but it was like highlighting the road or something. And it was yeah, because like, it, it can't road. place it on the road. Yeah, okay. I didn't want it to anyway. I wanted it like nope. that, and that's how I got it. It's <laughs> good. This is what I want. Uh -huh. So, because you've only placed one green like you can build here thing on the map you're going to need to uh, run power to where that area is so f from anywhere along that line of like power lines you've made just 
go down from there to near where that green square you made was. I didn't remember where it was. But don't don't go through the road because that anywhere you place something, yeah, go over there like that. That'll do, yeah. This will cover him with electricity. <laughs> it's yeah. gonna be covered in electricity. Utterly covered in like electricity. Like pudding. <laughs> what is this now? That's I'm not connected to anywhere else uh, symbol, but like it will be the second if there is actually anyone living there. Yeah. Yeah. So now you can probably unpause time again and go back to the like zoning menu. There you go. So you need to you're gonna need to make a green somewhere on the opposite side of the road. Yeah, like there and maybe one to the right of it or something. Right, there you go. If you go to like power men the power menu again, you'll now see like the area of influence is like that. Oh. Oh, I see. So it touches something and then it just spreads along. Like if I were to build yeah. all the way here, it would all get electricity. It's basically like saying there's underground power lines. Well, yeah, there ought to be. So, hold on. I didn't have to build this line down here. I could have just like put houses here or yeah. something. But for whatever reason, you chose to put a green thing down here. Because I thought I could just place some housing and then it would unlock more things, like you said. Like, just put down something to unlock the next thing. <laughs> You can leave it running. There's there's no downside to leaving things running. Those houses are going to moan at you now for not giving them electricity. Yeah, I'm going <laughs> to take them down. I'm going to uh, get rid of these houses. <laughs> Welcome to Cronionsby. Get out. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you get for moving to my town. <laughs> Oh, how do I unpaint this? I don't want more people to uh, move there. The brown one, not far right. Mm. Brown is your friend. There, now. Go forth and have electricity. Why don't you have electricity? You need to yeah wait until someone moves in because when there's not actually a house there, there's mm. no like there's no underground power system yet. So for whatever reason, they're moving incredibly slowly. If you you know where you're pressing like pause on the bottom left hand corner of the screen. Oh, here it comes! Here it comes, Muda. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want me to do this? Just for like a minute. It really should just be like either. Pause or full throttle. There doesn't need to be any in between. <laughs> well, because then when something happens, sometimes. you just pause it. Yeah, but if you need to think, just pause it and think, and then just be like, Bwah! But, but like, there's pretty much no reason to ever pause because you're always, unless you're in like what the situation we are right now, which is we're losing money every second unless we're building in everything. So there is a reason right now, but when you're in the green, there's never really a reason to pause. So there's no downside to you utterly covering this entire circle with green. I just want to unlock the next thing, but I guess people have to live here first for anything else to happen, yeah? Yeah. If you want to do it like a quarter circle at a time, that's probably better, because if people move in on the circle where there's no power going to them and it's going to moan at you like little whiny babbies. <laughs> so they're all moaning about water because you haven't put water to that area. I oh. thought they're covered. Maybe they are, maybe they're Let's not. See. Oh. <gasps> what? You just you did have water to them and you got a uh, I'm a pioneer. You just got a just got a thingy. An achievement. Yes, achievement get. Delchivo. 
<laughs> that character's dead now. Yeah. Um, I think that they're just saying water because it's just like they just built it. And they're like, oh wait, I found some water. Actually, never mind. <laughs> it's like that lady who couldn't um, get out of her car because mm. it was locked, and she didn't know there was a button to unlock it. <laughs> right. So now you can see now people are living here. There's blue and orange need. Which is, which for whatever reason is in fact yellow need. Uh, so blue is places to shop, and yellow is places to work, pretty much. Mm -hmm. Like some people do work at shops, but the majority of people end up working in industrial. When you first start the game, you only have shitty normal industrial, which is like pollution making industrial. Yeah. After a while, you get you unlock like other kinds of industrial but we haven't got those at the moment so you probably want to make a road off this circle and start going if you press the top left hand corner first yeah uh, no we don't have anything about resources so we, we I can't tell you about resources but frankly it's probably off to the right that there's resources like farming and forestry. <coughs> oh, whoops, I'm doing the curved way. Curved penis. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's what I thought too. Okay. So, because the way you've built, you probably want to start building things Along nearer there, the so left. Yeah, so we don't so have to like make more electricity connections. Yeah. Or I can just connect it through here. I don't care. Yeah. Evil one. Little Miss Smirt. Like so. Oh, no, it connected itself. It, it did. It did just before I clicked, didn't it? Very nice. A very oh, good. they're still demanding more and more. I guess I better give them like, what they want. It takes time for their uh, their needs to like go away. So don't, don't ever build too much. Unless you're about to build a load more new houses. Because mm -hmm. it's best to like give them what they want a bit and then wait and give yeah. it to them and then wait again. <laughs> yeah, you have to wait. You can't do it like every five minutes. That's You gotta wait a little bit. Yeah. Non-localized non-localized uh, like shopping in my opinion is better. Yeah, we're just kind of spread out until like late game where you just want to be like shopping zone, mm. housing zone, industrial zone. They're still moaning about water and it's been a while, the industrial people, so maybe you didn't connect that up enough. Oh yeah, no I didn't. <laughs> well, I hope it's not a water industry. I'll do you one better. I'll give you 15. I can do better than that. <laughs> yeah, that's what it was, wasn't it? You still haven't given them water, you know that, right? Did I put a pipe. One dude's still demanding you, you need like he anywhere that's farm? anywhere that's brown is not done. So you may as well go from the right pipe to the left pipe and just fill it in. Because you're probably going to put more stuff on that road later, right? Thank you. What's this wrong? will this will be much more efficient next time. Yeah. I don't think I explained it very well. 
No, it's okay. It's just like there are things that only make sense once you've done something, you know, and then once you've done it, you're like, oh, it would be better like this. And you can sit there and explain it. You can use thousands of words and it might sink in. Mm -hmm. Right, so if you're looking in the industrial area we've got at the moment, they're all demanding workers, so basically build more housing. Mm. Oh, when can I have a high density residential please? Oh, that's literally a millennia away. Well then why were you saying like just place it so it unlocks like other things? Like uh you meant like other things, not other residential zone types, yeah. yeah. Mm. My mistake. That's why I'm saying pretty much just place residential on this circle because you're gonna like bulldoze it all in a, in a minute and place what you actually want here this circle's probably gonna end up being something like a shopping zone because it's the yeah. first place they enter kind of yeah, thing. yeah exactly so. i can't imagine people wanting to live right at the entrance to town it's, no. it just seems shitty that all these people are gonna have to move eventually and well this is if you're thinking about it like just oh, because this game doesn't have like a this is the 19th century and this is the 20th. There's no like time yeah. progression, which I think would be much better in a kind of cities game. Like, uh, it should start by, okay, so you've got, you do have the same things we have unlocked here, which is like low density and high density, but it's like you start off by low density and it looks like you're in like farms and stuff like that. Like you're out in the, in the wilderness and then like slowly time elapses and like you build stuff and it actually becomes more high tech and stuff like that but but like yeah so basically it's it's starting off in time like these houses are just here and then you're going to start doing things you know words words Many and words. dem dare stuff so, before you start moving too far, we've only got two wind turbines. Click on your power thing and click on your water thing. So we're still good for electricity. You can see that in the top left hand corner that we're still in the green. And water. We're still, still good for that. Right, golden cool. water showers. <laughs> Not enough money. <clears throat> yeah, you'd, you'd need to build more industrial until that red number starts becoming green and now then we're going to have to sit here and wait for a while. How does a water tower create noise pollution? <laughs> they lock us in the tower whenever we can <laughs> Yeah, it's, of course, it's the Animaniacs. They keep popping out. <laughs> I knew it. I knew they were real. So it's a oh, shouting yeah. match you want, is it? Ah! Ah! <coughs> I'm totally beating you! So, build more industrial. You sure? Because yeah. I just did. Doesn't it take some time? It's like when you eat. Very slightly, but I mean. Okay. I think these people need to go to school. Am I right? Well, you don't even have any schools yet because you haven't got enough people in oh. your city yet. Oh. How many people live here? That many people? <gasps> yeah. Oh. Almost. Almost. Come on, one more guy. Yeah. Woohoo! So now I can tax them. I can borrow money. Yeah. If you want growth, you probably don't want to go above 10%. Most people push it up to 12% later, but like... Taxes? Yeah. yeah. But like, uh, you don't need to. You're, they're more than happy to just sit on whatever normal thing. It kind of looks like... It kind of looks like I've made money, because I started out with negative money and now I have money, so I don't really need to tax them that much. No, but I mean, like, Do the I? more, the, each time you put down one of those things, it's going to cost a lot of that green. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you need to, like, keep being making it positive every time you put something down. See, because it's a one way road, you're seeing how it's, you're not getting coverage to the right, but you are getting coverage to the left. What does coverage, what does coverage look like? the green that you're seeing. Uh -huh. So it's like a bright green to your left and it becomes like grayer and grayer as you as you go around because mm -hmm. it's it's a school it's like yeah, if you put it pretty much on that road 
yeah, it, it's stuff that goes towards it. It's, it's like f going towards it instead of like going away from it. <laughs> stuff that goes towards it is like going towards it instead yeah. of going away from it. Yeah. Mm. Is it people, like a river? People Phil? go to a school. People don't come from a school. Is what I'm meaning. So. They go in and they never come out again. <laughs> As in, if you were to place down a police station, police people come from the police station rather than like. Okay. Yeah. So it's like these are the people who would be going to that school. Yeah. So if this was a two-way road, we'd be covered unbelievably fine in all of this area. But because like it's a one-way road, we're just getting a really short amount of distance. So if you're probably going to be building residential to the left, you probably want it as close to the left as possible. Do you just want to say when to click? Because I'm just Anywhere like coasting around. Look how pleased they are! So the two new other things you got are also hospitals and garbage. It needs to be against a road. There you go. Now garbage has an unbelievably gigantic catchment area, so you basically only need like one okay. until you really start building an ass load of stuff. And hospitals work the s I think the same as schools, but I'm not completely sure. I can't. Yeah, exactly they can go that. out of town for their hospital needs. There's no hospitals. They just die, sadly. They're gonna die anyway. Yeah. Water, you say? What are you saying? Oh, you very, very slightly. That tiny bit of industry, for whatever reason, has decided to just, like, run it over. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to do, but I guess I... Why? Bottom right-hand corner? I... I... I must have clicked it twice. There you go. Maybe if you paint that area a little wider, instead of a two wide. Either that or just make another. I thought it like I thought I did like all of this instead of just like two by two. I thought that's what happened, but let's it's because find out. it's because you stopped at that point. If you if you paint like two more lines. Like four by four. Uh oops. Well, it's there. That's where it is now. Like the biggest something becomes, I think, is six, six, six by, six by four. So there you go. Yeah. Why did my speed go down again? Whenever you get a a ding, like a city level up, it puts mm. you back down to normal speed. Mm. <coughs> but also, whenever you get a ding, it also like gives you a big load of cash. So, it's always nice. <coughs> so, you're at full I want to live here need. So, no one, no new factories are being built. You could start pa like upgrading those houses by giving it a hospital because the more like services a house has, the more chance that it's going to upgrade. And at the moment it's covered by education, garbage, water and power. Was that a two-way road? I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, that was a two-way road. Since you got that, you could theoretically remove that line in between the two roads. You pretty much yeah, solved I'm it. To f I'm trying to figure this out. What happened? They can only go right from here, or they could go straight. Straight. And yeah. Then the people coming the other way can only go 
this way, just left for them. But yeah. Uh, so this doesn't make it crazy, does it? I didn't just do something crazy. Not incredibly crazy. He basically made it so people can go back on themselves. If you do it, if you make a cross out of it instead of just one line, you've made it better. I'd say. Make it like a cross through the circle rather than like, like make it this way. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh! Do you mean take this away that I just did and do this one instead of this one? Either would probably be good. And what about this that I took away? Did I just complicate things for people That's living the, on this I, no, side? No, I'd, I'd say. I'd say it's fine. Like, you very slightly have, yeah, but... <laughs> yeah, because we're I mean, that's, go now? that's this many people. That's like six people. Are we really going to care about six extra bits of traffic? I don't know, maybe you're right. Maybe I should take this away and just do that way. Oh, I get a refund when I demolish roads? Small amount of refund. Better than nothing. I thought it was, you know, nothing. <clears throat> Bye, sorry. <laughs> You can make it into a sign. <laughs> hmm? You can make it into a peace sign. No. No. <laughs> I could, but no. Yeah, because because you've now changed the roads, it's very slightly unpainted parts of the squares. It'll automatically come back over time, but otherwise you you can repaint them. I mean, look, look to like the left of where you point, paint, made that road across. Like one of the six squares now doesn't have the back two squares. This one. Yeah, there's that, and there's the one directly mm. across the road from it. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, because the road connected there. Because mm. <clears throat> every time you change the roads, it changes the like dynamics of the sides of the roads. Because it has to like deform it slightly. Mm -hmm. Oh, water, water, water! What is they it with you people? Nobody wants any blue at the moment. No. Oh, oh, maybe they whoops. want a slight bit of blue. They will once there's more houses. Okay. Water, water everywhere. And none of it's for you. <laughs> that's how that, that's how the poem goes. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure. Oh, so you're still in the positive? Nice. Oh, wow, I am, yeah. Oh, crap, I wanted to put a hospital in there somewhere. Okay, no one lives here yet. So... Well, you can just smash down the No house. money! Yeah, we're gonna have to wait a while. So don't yeah. don't pause it, unpause it, and just wait. Well, I just don't want anyone to live here before, because I don't want them to have to be evacuated when I build the hospital. Although, They don't cares, get evacuated. Right? They literally just drop an entire hospital on top of them. Oh, well, that's even worse. We, we want this. Okay. <clears throat> He's the boss, ladies and gentlemen. I crush you. With a house. I mean, with a hospital. It's like, it's like Wizard of Oz, but with a hospital. <coughs> I need a little dog, too! Cronion's B. <laughs> <laughs> Is there anything I There's can no do? There's no place like Cronion's B. There's no place like Cronion's B. <laughs> Thank God for that. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, look at how dirty the ground is getting from pollution. Just deal with it. Just make they... like a tiny, like, just make a tiny line, just like that way in towards them. Yeah, done. Special delivery water for the big babies. <laughs> uh, I want the cinnamon roll. 
Cinnamon. Yeah. So, you now need a shit ton more houses. <laughs>